Hello everybody, it's Marky. How's it going? Magic Kingdom, Walt Disney World. It's great to have you here. Please say hello in the chat. Let me know where you're watching from, what country, what city, what state. It's a Tuesday night here at Magic Kingdom. Wow, the castle looks beautiful. Let's see what's going on. What's going on tonight at Magic Kingdom? Hello, hello, Red Rocker. What's up, buddy? How are ya? Thanks for dropping in. So did you finally do Tron? You said you were at Tron the other night? I think on Saturday, right? Hello everyone, welcome in. What's going on? How's it going? Happy Tuesday night. I made it to Magic Kingdom and it's still daylight. Look at that. Sun is going down, but it's still daylight. Still have some, some daylight. Little daylight going on. Let's see if the chat will turn on. And it's working. All right, everything looks cool today. All right, all right, all right. Mike Beachman, what's up, buddy? Man, the pictures were amazing. <laughs> I love that Mickey Mouse looking out the window of the car. <laughs> Elizabeth from Ohio, what's up? How's it going, Elizabeth? How are you? All the way from Ohio. Hello, Ohio. When are you coming down this way? Oh, Red Rocker, good to know. You enjoyed it. I'm glad nobody got sick. That's great, man, that's great. Thank you, Mike Beachman, as always, holding it down for me. Thank you so much, man. Very cool, Mike. Thanks for being here, Elizabeth. Hi Kylie, how are you? What's going on Kylie? Kylie, did you see me on Speedway yesterday? I think you always leave before I go on Speedway. Yeah Kylie, you can be mod, but I, I have um, too many mods right now. You gotta wait. Wait till the opportunity comes up. And uh... Now don't forget, you gotta take the class with uh, 
Pete McDevitt, sign up to his class on, go to uh, Pete McDevitt's channel, sign up for the, the mod class. It's free. And that's how you become a mod on my channel. Oh, cool, Red Rocker. I'm glad. Glad to hear. Brian Whitney. What's up, Brian? Hey, Mickey Stein's here. What's up, Mickey? Always great to see you, Mickey. Well, I'm testing the sound. I, may, I changed some settings today on the microphone, so let me see. Yeah, I noticed that yesterday was kind of sounded far away. Let me see how this sounds today. Testing, one, two, three, I got my uh, ninja on. One, two, three, one, two, three, testing sound. Oh, Red Rocker, maybe you should try the, the upright chairs that they have on the one of the uh, trains. You know, like there's three of them. One of the trains has the seats in the back so you can sit up straight. Just stand, uh, ask them to let you stand in row seven. If you stand in row seven, you can wait for the car with the uh, upright seats. Getting pretty packed getting pretty packed people anticipating already fireworks and getting their spots feels like we might get a little we might get a little uh rain little rain little rain All right, let me try it again. Turning on the chat. Yeah, it's working. PIP is working as well. There we go. <laughs> How's it looking, guys? How's it looking? We had that little hiccup there, a little heat up. All right, let me turn the PIP off. All right, cool, Mickey. Thank you, Mickey. All right, awesome, awesome. Huh? This time of day is so nice because it starts to cool down. It's just awesome. It's cooling down pretty quickly. It almost feels like we might get some rain. 
It almost feels like rain might be coming. I know there is a cold front heading this way. Not sure if we're gonna have a, a big cool down or not, but it seems like it's been pretty warm, so I don't know. It'd be cool if we get a, a nice cool down over here, Florida. Oh yeah, take a take a look at the um, at the hub. <laughs> it's getting crowded, right? I took a peek down Main Street <clears throat> as I was walking this way. I was like, wow. The afternoon crowd is moving in. They're moving in. I'm one of them. <laughs> the afternoon crowd. We're here. Yeah, the monorail was packed. Packed, packed, packed. Parking lot, packed. <laughs> so I'm expecting a packed night. <laughs> Very crowded, guys. It's so awesome here, though. There's enough space for all of us, guys. All of us. <laughs> we can all enjoy. Yeah, I'm gonna have to stop here and take a look at the castle because it looks amazing and we're losing light pretty fast. Check out the sky. It's a lot of cloud coverage. Sun is, I think, that way. Hmm, I lost the sun. Oh, wow. This view always, man. Always great. Oh, thanks, Mike Beachman, for letting them know. Yeah, the camera was a little bit overheated there for a second, but I, I just stuck the ice there, and man. Plus, now it feels like it's cooling down. The camera's warming up. I can feel it. But the uh, weather here is cooling down a little bit. It's been so hot. It's really rough on the cameras, you know? Red Rocker, we're doing great. Eva is out of town, so you won't be seeing her on my blog, I mean, I mean on the uh, lives this week. But she'll be back on Saturday. Daniel's here, what's up, Daniel? How are you, buddy? Always great to see Daniel here. How's it going, Daniel? How was your day today? What are you up to tonight? Oh yeah, that's true, Mike. Uh, Mike Beachman. Um, yeah, with Enchantment coming to an end, even though everybody complained that they hate Enchantment, <laughs> they all want to see it before it goes. That's so funny to me. Because I love it. And I keep hearing everybody hating on Enchantment. I don't know, I just love it. I love both shows. I think both shows are awesome. They use mostly, I have both of them recorded, so I've watched them back to back. They they use the same kind of like fireworks setup. Just change up the songs and the projections. Fireworks are mostly the same ones used, same style, you know, same, uh, uh, what do you can call, maybe you can call it like scene, firework scenes. Firework scenes seem to be the same. Just the background kind of changes, the music and the uh, projections. But yeah, so yeah, it's a busy one and everybody's grabbing their spots over there at the uh, at the front, at the hub right in front of the castle there. So let's take a walk, see what's happening around the kingdom. Sleepy Hollow, always busy. <laughs> People constantly come here. It's so good though, man. So good. And I love the I love that it's so next to the so close to the castle. Get your umbrellas in case it rains. I don't think these will hold up in the rain, would they? Seems so more like uh, something just for fashion, I guess. <laughs> or your enjoyment, but not really for thunderstorms. Flag is waving. All the presidents. Oh man, I I love this tree. The Liberty Tree.
The story of how it was brought here is right here on the plaque. If you ever come here, you gotta read it. It's pretty interesting, but it's beautiful. Lanterns, the uh, lanterns should be turning on pretty soon because uh, all the lights are turning on around the park. Oh, Dilo's here. What's up, Dilo? Great to see you, Dilo. Daniel's getting comfy. <laughs> ah, cool, Daniel. Glad you're here, hanging out with us. Everyone in the chat together here. Yeah, Red Rocker, thanks. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I am. 4K. So click the settings wheel, a little, uh, you know, a little wheel, and uh, make sure you choose 2160p, and you, will, you should see a nice, 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 clear picture. Let me walk a little bit. What else is happening over here? It's getting a little windy, which is nice, man, because it's cooling me down and it's cooling my camera down. The Liberty Bell. Oh, wow, look at that. The lights just turned on. There are the lanterns. They just turned on too. On the uh, Liberty Tree. Isn't that cool? I love when the lanterns pop on. Such a beautiful tree. This area here is nice. Liberty Square. So nice. Very um, beautiful. Oh man, I love the weather rain up there too. You know, the architecture here is just incredible, man. I'm always in awe. <laughs> I love it. somebody was proposing for a second. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, you. There's the Liberty Bell. Ah, she's closed for the night. One of the bad things about coming at this time, you can't go to uh, Tom Sawyer Island. You can't ride the Liberty Bell steamboat. So that's one thing. You get here too late. There's a couple things that you miss out on. Also, Pinocchio's Village closes early. So if you're looking forward to getting that pepperoni pizza, you gotta get here earlier. <laughs> Cause they close, I don't know, somewhere between five and seven. I think they were nice that they were closing at 5.30. There might be exceptions, you know. I gotta find out if maybe they stay open tonight. <laughs> stay open late. I don't know, last night I didn't have dinner. Maybe tonight I won't have dinner. I'll skip it. So, so, I'm so weird, I don't like eating alone for some reason. So I'll just skip dinner. Wow, look at that, Splash Mountain all covered up in scaffolding. When they start uh, renovating areas or retheming, you just can't wait to see it new again, you know? Or what's gonna happen, you know? I mean, we all know that's being redeemed to uh, Tiana's Bayou Adventure. And I'm looking forward to seeing that, but you know, the wait, <laughs> the waiting is just so much, man. So much. There's the water wheel. Ah, there is the Haunted Mansion in the background, way back there. Oh, thank you, Dilo. <laughs> yeah, if I if I can't if I can't go, <laughs> if I can't you know if I feel like I'm not gonna make it through the night without eating, I'll I'll have to eat something with you guys. <laughs> Did you guys already have dinner? Everyone, you already? What's uh, what's on the menu for tonight? 
Well, what did you have tonight? Uh, thank you, Daniel. You know, you really do feel like you're with, with, with people, you know, like you, I know you guys are virtual, whatever, but it feels like you're here, you know, when you're reading all the comments in real time. It really does feel like, hey man, all my friends are here. <laughs> it's so cool. Even though I look crazy as everyone walks by, I'm just talking to myself, as you can see. I get um so many weird looks <laughs> and stares. <laughs> it's a funny thing. I'm used to it already though. Ooh, Brian Whitney pizza. That's what you're having? Oh man. Oh man. That's my favorite food, I think. I think that's really my favorite food all time. Pizza. And I think second place is just good fresh baked bread. Oh my god. Yeah. Burgers. Mike, you tried again? Mike, you gotta like cook them at, you gotta be more patient, cook them at a slow, slow fire, you know? So that um you don't burn them. <laughs> And it's worth it, it's worth it. Unless you like them well done, if you like them well done, uh, sometimes you can just cut them in half so that they cook better, if you like them well done, and then um, just put them together on the bun like that. You won't even know. <laughs> Especially if you cut the bun in half. <laughs> yeah, tell us, Mike, Mike Beachman, how did, how did they turn out? <laughs> Do you make two of them for yourself or just one? Ooh, Red Rocker, you were in the burger mood too. Man, you guys are making me hungry. I can't talk about food now. <laughs> it's fine, I'm fine. I can, I, can, I can deal with it. Oh, nice, Brian, grilling outside. Very nice. So good, so good. Always awesome. Bears are not, not out tonight. They may be taking a break or done for the night. You never know. They might come out. They're usually up there. <clears throat> right. I like this um, hardware store right here. It's so well themed, I love it. Hardware, they got seed, they got ammo boxes up there. That is so cool. On the bottom it just says general store candies and drinks. The Prairie Outpost and Supply. Love that too. And Pickles Bill, always fun to uh, come here with Eva and enjoy a meal. We're due, man, we're due to come out for a dinner to the park. She's working hard this week because she's she's putting in overtime to this week. Eva got to go to um, Catalina Island on Saturday. Some of you might know already, she posted a video today, I think it I think it was today posted a video she saw some buffalo out there buffalo or bison i think it was bison bubbles love the bubbles i'm always running into a bunch of bubbles a lot of them
Thunder Mountain is always so crowded. I wonder why. Because it's such a cool ride. So fun. I haven't taken you on there anymore because the last few times I lost the stream on there. It goes so fast that it can't hold the signal. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'll try again one of these days. Now, the one thing about uh, streaming at night is you do lose quality. And I can open up the lens a little bit. Let's see. Let me know if it's looking good, guys. If not, I'll open up the lens, see if I can get some more light in it. Because it's kind of getting dark. Big thunder. Oh, thank you, Red Rocker. The green and the blue, the blue and green. Awesome. Even though we have not much light left, I do have flashlight I can turn on. Let me see. There we go. Lights up a little bit. Maybe it's too early to use that, but yeah, it's on right now. I'll turn it off. That's the difference right there. Oh, so Mike says he made two, two burgers and they were fine. Awesome, Mike. I'm glad you got to enjoy some good burgers, not burn ones, burnt ones. <laughs> no fun, man, when you're cooking and you burn your food, right? Definitely no fun. <laughs> Danny, I missed that one. We don't talk about dinner. No, no. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, I better put my sunglasses away before I lose them. They're on the top of my head and I know that I've broken a bunch of them like that because I'll swing my head and they'll fly. So let me go ahead and pop them out. Let me stop somewhere around here where I can put them back in my bag so that I don't lose them. <laughs> it's tight over here, man. Ooh. All right, I made it through. I made it through. Wow, look at the line, guys. It's so crowded. I've made that line before all the way from down here. It feels like forever because once you get up there and you think you're <laughs> you're there, then you wind and wind and wind around and it's like another hour or so <laughs> or half hour as you wind back and forth. All right, let me see before I uh, mess up my glasses. Let me put them in my bag. Here at Miner's Cove. We'll get grab a sip of water. I'm thirsty. <laughs> Here's a hidden cannon right here. It's hidden like right behind this bush right here. So if you're coming coming to invade the island, it's right there. Just be careful. <laughs> be careful you don't want to run into that cannon. All right, I'm on the pier again. There are the rafts that go to Tom Sawyer Island. Oh my God, this breeze is really feeling good, guys. Really feeling good. I'm loving it. Look at the windmill. Windmill goes round and round, round and round, round and round. <laughs> oh wow, Brian, hot dogs and hamburgers. <laughs> nice, very nice. Do you guys notice any improvement in the sound from yesterday or the day before till today? I was saying earlier, I did adjust the microphone. Uh, I don't know if I did a good job though. Just wondering if it's coming through pretty loud or just low too low or whatever it sounded to me like yesterday i sounded far away so i did a little adjustment there thunder mountain
Brian, yeah, I walk a lot, man. And today I parked all the way at the end and I was thinking, oh, you know what? Maybe I'll walk all the way to the end. And, um, you know, it's so healthy for you. I always feel good when I walk a lot. So I, I was thinking, man, you know, yesterday I walked to the car because it was right there. I was the first row. Today I'm like almost the last row. That would be a nice walk. Let's see if I'm <laughs> in the mood of walking. I might not because, yeah, you know, from here to there. <laughs> I'll change my mind. I'm here to then. Let's head up there and check out the train before it gets too dark to see it. We'll head up this way, which is Nugget Way. There it is. Nugget Way. We're running up Nugget Way. Nugget Way. Nugget Way. <laughs> Let's see if we can catch it on the way on the way over here. Oh, there it goes, heading up. Ooh, Don't you want to be on there right now, guys? Yeah. <laughs> Nobody shouted this time, very quiet. <laughs> Let's check out the lookout over here in the corner. Hey, the geyser is not working. Geyser took a day off. It's got the night off. <laughs> the geyser is silent tonight. There's a lonely lizard over there <laughs> looking for water. There's no geyser, buddy. You're gonna have to go all the way down there. All the way to the edge of the river. The rivers of America. Oh man, the swinging bridge. Man, I love going to Tom Sawyer Island. I wish they would never close it. You know, not till closing time. <laughs> but it's under understandable, man. I've been over there. I've seen snakes over there. So it is dangerous at night over there. You might encounter something you don't want to, you don't really want to encounter. <laughs> Come on, lady. Oh, wow, we have a princess. <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> Little Cinderella. Oh, another Cinderella, I think. See another blue dress. Big Thunder Mountain Railroad. Oh yeah, by the way, Nathan called me out or helped me out with the, uh, I called Splash Mountain, Big Thunder Mountain the other day. <laughs> Crazy. And yesterday I called the monorail. I called it the tram when I was watching. <laughs> I was watching the uh, the replay. I called it the tram. What is going on in the brain sometimes? <laughs> Crazy things, man, that you say when you're live. Probably say it in real life, but you don't realize it. But since you're recording yourself, you can hear yourself talking <laughs> later on and be like, what? What did I say? That's just wrong. <laughs> It's funny, we probably do that throughout the day, you know? All right, let's see what's going on over here. We know the store is closed. Ooh, the signs are gone. Signs on the store are gone. At the uh, Splash Mountain attraction. Well, formerly Splash Mountain. What else is gone? Oh, last time I saw, I think I saw the bear. The bear's over there. Actually, the rabbit was there, the bear. But no, not now. I don't see them popping up through the through the back there. So I'm not gonna ride the train, so I'm not gonna head that way because the train station is right there. Just wanna see if I see anything different happening over here. Down by the river. We came that way, so let's go head up this way. Let's do in incline.
Ooh, squirrel. <laughs> squirrel up there on top of the... Whoa, he just jumped to the tree. Whoa, there he goes. Can you guys see him? There he is. He's agile, man. He jumps pretty good, man. He goes from one thing to the other. From the tree to the mountain. From the rooftop there, a little rooftop. That was pretty cool. Squirrel. Oh, let's see what's happening here. Oh, yeah, you can see the scaffolding better here. Man, they got a lot of work to do, man. To turn this into Tiana's Bayou Adventure. Oh, I see a message is coming in. Let me uh, grab my glasses and park it so I can, I can read them. Man, we are losing light quick. But there's a lamp right here. I can see. <laughs> I'm so silly. Brian, I'm joking, of course. Okay, what were you guys talking about? Tyler, what's up, Tyler? Happy Tuesday, Tyler. Nice to see you. Red Rock, I was, at, I was at MK myself, by myself, for a while on Saturday and rode the train around twice. Oh man, cool. Two loops, that's pretty nice. I enjoy the ride, man, I, I love the train. It's so nice. So nice to have it back too, you know? It's been a long time, man. What's up, Tyler Silva? Good to see you, buddy. Thank you for being here, hanging out with everyone. How's the picture looking, guys, with this uh, darkness? How's it looking? Let me show you what I can do. I can lighten this up, bring in some light, like that, make it brighter. That might be too bright, overexposed. So I can adjust the exposure a little bit. And I think I messed it up. <laughs> Let me get it back to where it was. <laughs> That's funny, Brian. The next blog, <laughs> wildlife. Daniel, you're back. It says welcome to the to Clever Mouse. Thank you, Daniel. Thank you. By the way, thanks to all club members. You guys are amazing. Thanks for joining my mouse club. I appreciate you guys doing that, man. It's so awesome. You don't even know. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. <laughs> Brian, <laughs> that's cool, Brian. I like I like your silly side too, man. Both of your sides are good. <laughs> You're all good, man. You're all good. Oh, wait. I didn't read all the messages. Hold, hold on. Hold on. Let me park it here on the side before I run into somebody with these glasses. All right. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Daniel, we don't talk about dinner. <laughs> we already read that one, the blue and green. Okay, cool, that was a Red Rocker. Then Brian had the hot dogs and the hamburgers. Brian, Red Rocker says, sounds yummy. Man, of course it does, especially when you're hungry like me right now. <laughs> no, I'm good, I'm good. I can hold out. And yeah, 10,000 miles, yeah. I know we usually do 15,000 steps or a little more. Sometimes 12,000, but we'll put it, we'll do like 15,000 steps, something like that. I think, uh, I think we've done, we've done like every time close to four miles or a little over four miles, which is great. Oh, wow, Red Rocker can't have grills. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Brian, you, you wish you park closer afterwards. <laughs> yeah, after you're done with the night here, yeah. Do I talk in my sleep? No, <laughs> I don't think so. Unless I'm having like a nightmare, which I never have nightmares. I always have funny dreams, man, for some reason. I'm always waking up in laughter. Eva has nightmares all the time. I'm always laughing <laughs> in my sleep. It wakes me up. I'll be laughing in my sleep and I wake up.
Yeah, Daniel's been a member for a while, and uh, some of the, some of uh, some of you guys um, come and go. I know it's not easy, but I thank you guys. If anybody wants to join, it's only one dollar ninety nine cents to join. It's just a way to support the channel. And thank you, club members, Mouse Club. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much. I'm still trying to work out things that I could do to make it interesting for you guys. If you ever have ideas, guys, send them to me. I mean, it's really hard to come up with something <laughs> that doesn't, uh, you know, bust the bank over here. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I was filling up my tank today to get here because I was out of gas after yesterday. And I'm like, oh my God, it's only Tuesday and I'm already out of gasoline. Pirate hats, Arr, girl. Love the pirate hats. You guys know, or if you don't know, I worked as a pirate entertaining tourists for over five years doing that. That was pretty cool. And I played in a band that was a pirate band. And uh, everyone was dressed as pirates. The singer was a female. She was a wench. <laughs> if we want to enlist to be pirates again, right here. Enlist right ahead. Here at the Pirates Adventure Treasures of the Seven Seas. Did you catch it? <laughs> All right, let's head into Adventureland. Time check. Still debating if I want to do fireworks. I haven't done, done them in a while. Fireworks, fireworks. Who wants fireworks? You guys want to see them from back here so I can do rides? Or do you want me to just sit there and wait? Because I would have to sit there for like an hour waiting for fireworks to to get a good uh, a good seat. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Brian. That's a great suggestion, how you get ready for the park. Pretty nice. Wow, look at that, 45 minutes, but it looks so full. Oh my God. Pirates looks packed. It's always packed. <laughs> Why am I surprised? I'm not surprised. It's an awesome ride. One of the, you know, all-time favorites. Oh, it's getting dark. It's getting dark. Yeah, it's, it's hot. Do you see her fanning herself? It's hot, man. <laughs> the wind died down on this side of the park. I don't know. This side doesn't get the uh, wind. Like over there in Liberty Square, right down the middle, by the castle. Let me see, maybe maybe after I pass this tiki, the tiki room. See if there's any breeze over here. Oh man, I wanna fly on the carpets, man. The breeze is amazing when you do that. And it rejuvenates you, man, because it's so hot. <laughs> Wow, it looks awesome here. Makes me want to go to Polynesian. It's been a while since I've been over there. Yeah. Feels like that. I mean, you and me were there for lunch on a, I don't know, Saturday or a Sunday? And it was awesome. Of course, we did uh, some videos of it, some blogs, whatever, but it was it was so cool. It was, it was nice to be there. I also started a stream from there, maybe last month sometime, I think. Yeah, it's, the line right now is pretty long for uh, for the carpets, flying carpets, Aladdin's magic, magical flying carpets. I think it is. I'm trying to remember the exact name. Oh, I just saw the camel spit water again. I was saying the other day that he's like a water hose, uh, like a a sprinkler for humans to cool you down. He's probably gonna spit now. Oh, there he goes. 
went right over that lady's head, did not hit her. That was funny. I know you guys can't see her probably, but there's a big puddle there on the floor where, where he's uh, spitting the water. So funny, so funny. Let me make a pit stop so I can read your messages, guys. So hard to walk with these uh, reading glasses. Vicky Stein, what's up, Vicky? Says I can't, can't fill my gas tank, my car. <laughs> Needs a new water pump. Oh no, a battery and a super serpentine belt. Oh my God, that's too much going on, Vicky. Oh my God. Michael, hello, Michael, what's up? How are ya? Always good to see you, Michael. Yeah, we're in Adventureland. It's really awesome here. Really awesome. Remember the other day we were supposed to grab some Dole Whip here and we didn't? After right next to Skipper Canteen where they have the... Uh... Ooh, more cannons. More hidden cannons. This area here is frequented by uh, pirates, so that's why you gotta be careful. Have cannons set up, avoid pirates, defend yourself. Skipper Canteen is right here, and then we have the Sunshine Terrace where they sell Dole Whip. So not only over there by Aladdin's Flying Carpet or the, by, the tiki, by the Tiki Room, over here you can get Dole Whip. Oh my God. You can get it in a cone, you can get it in a cup, you can get the swirl, and, oh wow, that looks good. Yummy, look at that. Sunshine, tree terrace. Mmm, look at the line for the uh, Dole Whip. <laughs> Pretty long line. Crystal Palace. Right here. Nobody knows that Crystal Palace is practically on the water. Well, a lot of people don't realize, but yeah, look. It's right on the water. Oh, Skippers has the uh, salads. <laughs> cool, Michael. Thank you. Yeah, even me had a... a a dinner there and we blogged it a while back maybe last year we have a blog in our dining uh, playlist <clears throat> eating there it's pretty good man it's good can't remember what i ate though but i remember being happy <laughs> when am i not happy <laughs> only when i lose my my wi-fi <laughs> it's getting crowded already man Everyone's waiting for fireworks. Oh my god, yeah, it's packed. <laughs> we go this way. I have not been to Fantasyland today, have not been to Tomorrowland today. And I walked down Main Street, but you guys weren't with me yet. I hadn't turned on yet. I wanted to start at the castle today. And we made our way back to the castle. Man, this, it's already, is it already eight? I can't tell, let me see. 802, oh my God. 
802 and it's so crowded. We sit here somewhere. Oh Alright guys, I think I'm gonna sit here and wait for fireworks. This is gonna hurt. My poor legs, <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Have I seen Timon? No, I haven't seen him today. They have the Timon Gold statue at Animal Kingdom. Hey, I wonder if they're gonna take all those away now. The statues, the golden statues. So Nathan, are you a fan of uh, Enchantment? Because a lot of people don't like Enchantment. I love it. Just wondering if you like it. I love Enchantment. I love Happily Ever After. And a lot of people don't like Harmonious. I find it strange, but Hey, everybody's different. I love Harmonious. I'm gonna miss Harmonious, but you know, I do have it recorded too. <laughs> I recorded all those, those uh, cool shows so many times. Whew. All right, I need to give my hand a little break. I'm gonna put the thing down, guys. Try to make some conversation amongst yourselves for a little bit. Guys, I had a bag of potato juice in my bag. I just found it. <laughs> I'm gonna down these. I'll be with you in a little bit. Let me eat these. I brought these last night. Yeah. 
Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Nice snap down would be good. <laughs> the stitch pillow, that big stitch pillow they have. It looks oh, yeah. like stitch sleeping. <laughs> yeah. That would come in handy now. <laughs> that one looks good too. Oh wow, <laughs> this cave always gets stuck somewhere, <laughs> hooked on something. Wow guys, that, that came in handy, having those chips in there, I didn't even remember that I had them. I was looking for somewhere to put my glasses safely, and wow, like a bag of chips. I thought I wasn't prepared today. That'll hold me now. Yeah, I was gonna ride a bunch of rides while fireworks were going off, like yesterday, but then I said, well, I did that yesterday, let's do something different today. That medallion is going to get uh, replaced pretty soon for the 100 one, I guess. Just guessing. <laughs> I don't really know, but it makes sense, right? Maybe they put the 100 there. Because we're celebrating uh, the 100 years of Walt Disney now. Which is amazing. Truly amazing. makers over here <laughs> one of the bubble makers in the crowd <laughs> I love those things <laughs> yeah. those things are really incredible how many bubbles they can make they go on and they go forever
<laughs> That's funny. <laughs> That's a lot of bubbles, man. Oh my god. We had a little skip there for a second. <laughs> How's it looking guys? We had a little skip. Man, the part where Tink flies is always amazing. <laughs> I love that. Thank you, Mike Beachman. Um, I think we have a little, a little, another little skip there. I'm not sure. Is everything all right now? Yeah, that's right, Brian. They do have one that looks a lot like her. Are you guys hearing me okay with all the people talking here? I wonder if you guys can hear me with the new adjustments I made. The Blu-ray, Michael, what are you, were you guys, were you asking me? Oh, thanks, Mike. Thanks, uh, thanks, Mickey Stein. Yeah, awesome to know. <laughs> Happy that the sound is good because, uh, yeah, yesterday I felt like it was way too low. I tried to bring it up a little today. Yeah, guys, set your settings to 2160p. Just hit that little wheel for the... Don't go anywhere. When that happens, we'll be right back. You know how it is here at Fireworks. It gets, it gets hard to uh, keep it perfect all, the whole time. The full show. Hopefully, 
Hopefully it will be good. Give me some good juju, guys. Send me some good vibes. Yeah, Mike. But well, it's been a while since I've been up here close. So I've been dying to be up here close. Where did they go? Okay, one sec. <laughs> yeah, Mike, thank you. Thank you, Brian. I appreciate the good vibes. Boys, yeah, that's right. <laughs> I'm glad, Michael. I'm glad you're having a good time. Thanks for being here. See, I'm about 100 feet in front of the castle, I think. I think 100, something like that. Maybe less, maybe less than 100. The wider angle looks makes the castle look far away. Oh, thank you, Mike. Mike Beachman, thank you so much. Yeah, guys. Join in. Join in the fun. Smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel, all that good stuff. Hit the bell, notification, turn them on so you know I'm here every week, so. It'll be my third year by this summer. Three years, guys, streaming over here. Join the club. Hang out with us every week. Whenever you need your Disney fix, I'm here, guys. I'm here. <laughs> All right, they want us to stand up. Everybody, stand up. Stand up. All right, we gotta stand up now.
Oh, cool, Brian. <laughs> yeah, you should be. I can still go a little wider. So. Hello, Stephanie, what's up? Good to see you again, Stephanie. <laughs> there we go, I can go. Wow, well, zoom out, and it looks like I'm really far, but I'm really close. <laughs> so I can do that. Forty-five minute drive to Sarasota Springs from our from our Airbnb. That's not bad at all. Chris, did you hear me? Forty-three minute drive from our uh, Airbnb to Sarasota Springs where the flamingos are. Forty-three? No, from our Airbnb. Nice, Michael. Yeah, let's have a magical time. Yeah. Where's the bubble maker guy? He's gone. I'm missing the bubbles now. Anybody else with a bubble maker? I don't see any. Oh, there's one up there in the air. Let's zoom in on the bubble maker. It's only going to be like two hours and I figured we'd hit the beach after. There's the bubble maker. That's what I'm saying, make a No bubbles, he must have run out. I think that guy ran out. Oh, that's the same kid. Yeah, he ran out because he had it going for a while. A lot of bubbles.
comfortable. It's a stand. Oh, I'm gonna use it as a stand. Let's see if this works. Oh yeah. All right, that's more comfortable. Using my backpack as a stand. <laughs> I put the uh, the camera inside, kind of like inside the backpack. Come on, focus. There we go. I'd rather have to work Charlotte oh, give my hands a break. Look, no hands, mom. No hands. No hands, mom. <laughs> <laughs> we still, I don't think, I don't know if we can check in early. We can probably ask. Oh, yeah, this is fun. I mean, 72 is one I'm so sorry, Mike. Let me check on my Ninja form. What in the world? I must have bumped into something when I was getting up. And then just say like what day it was, and, like what I enjoyed if I remembered about that picture, and the signature spot for us. Where we were when that picture was taken. You know what I mean? <laughs> Oh my god, Mike Beachman. What in the world? Mike, see if you're back, Mike Beachman. Should be back. Looks like I bumped into uh, something when I was standing up. I'll come here, I'll fly in Orlando, get a rental car, and pick somewhere like in the Midwest to go to. It home. says I had hidden you from the channel. I just unhid you. <clears throat> I hit you from the channel by mistake. I just put it back. I think it was, I think it happened when I was standing up. <laughs> I'm so sorry, bro. I could have cut the frog and Let me check, I'll fix it. Oh, no, there's other way to come to Barry. There's the monorail. You can see. I'd rather keep it right behind and just stand and wait for my boat. Yeah, there's the monorail, there's the ferry, and there's a bus, right? The monorail and the ferry. Oh, there you are. I'm going to kill my battery before the fireworks start. No. Hold on a second, guys. Let me fix this. Oh, it's 8.38. Oh, wow. 22 minutes. Oh, wow. On my way there, Mike. Hold on.
to be back. Back in blue. <laughs> this is crazy, man. All I did was stand up. I must have like, my thumb must have touched something on the phone. Remember when we blocked the CT? Oh my God. Yeah, thank you, Peyton. Man, I appreciate that. I hadn't even noticed. Oh my God. Dude, I must have hit something. It says I was trying to super chat forty nine ninety nine. <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> it wasn't easy being green. <laughs> Man, I'm so sorry, bro. So sorry. Feeling blue again. <laughs> man, that's so funny how this crazy stuff happens, man. <laughs> yeah, Brian, I'm cracking up too, man. That's cool, Peyton. We got like 20 minutes. I believe it's right at 9 on the dot today. So like 20 minutes? It's 8.40. I'm not even holding the uh, gimbal now. I'm just like on my on my ninja phone. I got the gimbal inside the backpack. Oh, Anthony! I didn't know you were here. <laughs> What's up, Anthony? Thank you, thank you too, man. Yeah, he's back, and now he's blue again. Looks like all your messages have been disappeared. <laughs> Mike, I'm sorry. Oh my God. Crazy stuff that happens on these streams. Remember yesterday it showed like I was upcoming all day. So, so happens that YouTube was updating the, um, the music, the music uh, studio. And they were adding all these new features. So when they've done that before, I've had issues. So yeah, yesterday when they were doing that, I was live and it, it changed all my my settings, everything. It's crazy. I don't know. Hopefully they are done and don't do anything tonight. Drop my camera. All right, I'm turning off the ninja. Half an hour left in the batter on the battery. So we make it through. I got more batteries, but I have to like oh my god. I have to like do a bunch of stuff here to get a battery on. I think I'll be alright. Oh look at those lights. They're testing, they're testing, they're warming it up. Ah, looks like they're warming up the lasers, I think. Those might be some of the lasers. Cool, and some cool lights there. Nice. Whoa, is that thunder? Oh my God, is that thunder, guys? Did you hear that? Oh my God, no. Oh my God, oh my God. Well, we just got hit by thunder, guys. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. Hoping for the best. We need pixie dust right now, guys. We need pixie dust.
Well, on Sunday, they, they canceled the show halfway through. Castle show. The uh, Friendship Fair. I wonder if somebody overheated or is just a track got stuck or something. I don't know. Let me check the weather real quick. The towels. Smells like rain. Smells like rain right now. Oh, they're not showing any rain. Just partly cloudy, expect. You never know in Florida, though. Man, I saw Tommy DeCarlo at, at uh, Epcot, man. He sounds so good. They found him through MySpace. He was uh, singing covers, uh, Boston covers on MySpace. Kind of similar story to um, to the Journey guy that, that joined Journey for a while. Right? So now he has his own band that plays Boston songs. He does a good job, man. Have Boston songs appeared like in movies? I can't remember right now if they were in any movies. You remember MySpace? <laughs> Mike Beachman? That was a website. Kind of like for musicians and artists. Before YouTube became the craze or Facebook became the craze. Oh no, Brian. Raining in Orlando? Oh no. Yeah, man, we want to see Tink fly. No. Hey, Carida, what's up? How are you? Thanks, Carida. Eva's out of town. She'll be back on Saturday. Hopefully when she gets back, we'll do the battle. Battle again, like we did on the weekend. Last weekend. Oh, I see bubbles again. <laughs> Almost 10 minutes. We are in the 
how it felt all day. Like, I couldn't even see my feet. Compared to the long spot, like, over the space area, it was pretty okay, too. There was, like, the one ride that came up here with the thing. And it was, like, a pretty high It wasn't, like, anything Good evening, dreamers and believers. In just 10 minutes, the Magic Kingdom invites you to join us as we journey into a world filled with wonder, discovery, and magic in tonight's presentation of Disney Enchantment, presented by Pandora Tooley. Our adventure begins in just 10 minutes. Thank you. Yeah, Miss Eva too, man. So much. God bless you. Welcome. song. Oh, no worries. We're all crammed in here, man. <clears throat> Few more minutes, guys. Oh, wow, we could get to 100 likes, guys. That would be awesome. You don't know what 100 likes does to a stream. It helps it so much. It gets shared so much more by YouTube. Help out, guys, if you can. Click the uh, like button, guys. Dreamers and believers. 
in just a few minutes, the Magic Kingdom invites you to enjoy our nighttime spectacular Disney Enchantment. All right, all right, all right. Oh, 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 sit down. In order sit for down you now. to fully experience to tonight's there. performance, the lighting around the Magic Kingdom will be reduced. For your own safety and for that of others, Stop we ask that. that you remain in the same location until the lighting returns to normal. Our journey will begin in just a few minutes. Thank you. Five minute countdown. The boat might be able to get us more people on there than the monorail would. second guys trying to get the new battery this one just died on me I'm gonna turn off the chat so I can see what I'm doing. Because it covers up the whole screen.
magic. And once upon a time, it all began with a dream. Yesterday, Disneyland and the New York World Fair. Tomorrow, a project so vast, it has already been called a whole new Disney World. As you can see on this map, we have a perfect location in Florida. There's enough land here to hold all the ideas and plans we can possibly imagine. Now, the magic of dreams come true is calling out to you, inspiring each of you to wish upon a star. Follow your hearts and discover a world full of wonder. Like those who have answered the call, if you allow your dream to be your guide, you may be surprised by what you discover so long as you simply believe. I remember someone told me fairy tales can come true. You gotta make it happen with all the friends on you. This time will slow you down. People taking it easy.
Thank you for joining us this evening for our nighttime spectacular Disney Enchantment, presented by Pandora Dream. We invite you to enjoy the rest of your evening here at the Magic Kingdom. Guys, did it work the whole way or what? Oh, cool, Payne, you were putting up the lyrics. Thank you so much, man. That's awesome. Did we lose any frames, guys? Somebody say something. I don't know if this is working or not. Michael, no, no. What does that mean? Did you see everything or did not see anything? Oh man. I'm scared now. Oh man, Mike. Damn. Dang, dang, dang. <laughs> I wish that wouldn't happen. Having a good time here. Waiting all that time and it doesn't come out perfect. So frustrating, guys. So frustrating.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna ride now, but look at the crowd. Look at the crowd. Look at all the people. Can't even walk. Waiting for more people to walk away so I can so I can walk because it's like really bad right now. Let's see if I can walk now. <laughs> it's crazy how packed this place is. Oh, look at this. You can't even walk. It's like... Look at that. To go that way, so hard. Let's go this way. This, this road is a little wider. Maybe we can get through on this side. <laughs> so dark.
Let's see how the Astro Orbiter is doing. Oh wow, it's a long wait. Sarah. Yeah, Tron closes at 8. Can't just get on it now. Nobody can get on now. Unless they change the hours for today. Yesterday they said 8 o'clock when I went. I was trying to get in. We did this one last night, two cups. We did um, so many last night. 
teacups, we did people mover, we did speedway. Wow, you really, you really need like lightning lane now to get out of anything. Everything is super packed. Oh my god, look at small. World. Thank you. 
And that's a lot of bubbles. <laughs> a lot of bubbles. <laughs> Let there be light. Sit down here for a second. Oh, what? Ow! Watch it. Yeah, you know, it makes like. Wow. That was a good walk. <laughs> One ride within an hour and a half, probably. Maybe it'll be a miracle if you can get in two rides right now. <laughs> Nathan, I'm having better luck. <laughs> I'm worried. I don't know how the show came out. The fireworks show. Drink me some water, guys. Amigos. Oh, why won't it focus? Oh man. <laughs> Three friends with the uh, big giant Mexican hats. <laughs> that was so cool, man. I'm sad that I didn't get a clear, clear picture of it.
Ooh, that light pulls in the way, but... See how Main Street USA is doing because the lines are crazy right now. I'm sure you guys don't want to wait an hour in line with me. <laughs> it's a long wait. We already did the hour at the um, at the castle. <laughs> that was an hour wait, guys. That was an hour wait. More than an hour. I think a little more than an hour. Oh, you got a lot of balloons out today. Whew. Oh, I took a picture next to these balloons today. I gotta post it. to get through there, man. Let's get some AC, man. I'm hot. That walk. <laughs> There's not much air in here. Um, I know a store that's really cold. Um, Town Square. Let's head over there. See if it's open. Get some AC, man. I need some air, some cold air. In the meantime, we enjoy everything that's happening here. <laughs> This store right, right here has great air conditioning. Oh yeah, that's good. Hmm. 
but not as good. It's really hot right now. Camera's like on fire. <laughs> because it's really hot. Camera's really hot. <clears throat> Let me see. It may have been off and I didn't even realize. It turns off on me. And it gets too hot. I go have the tacos at Pickles Bill. Yum. Right, I'm not sure. I thought I thought that maybe I lost it because because the phone overheated now. But maybe it's okay. It looks okay. I don't know. I may have missed some frames or something. A little bit of a uh, few frames. on the boat and find that nice AC. Yeah, the boat. There's a vent in here. Oh my god. <laughs> that feels so good. I ran out of water. I think I gotta get some. I think there's so many people that are sucking up all the good air out there. It even smells funny like, all over the park. <laughs> like, what's going on? Whew, that feels good. Oh my god. That was good. See what's happening at Tomorrowland Terrace.
it's the after party after party <laughs> that you pay extra for and you get to uh, wine and dine over there and there are the drinks alcohol Whew. enjoying a walk I think I like walking more here at uh, Walt well, Disney World or at Magic Kingdom than, than, at, than on the uh, treadmill. This is more fun. <laughs> and you do sweat a lot. <laughs> Flat floor, 15 minutes.
No, no, go ahead.
Hey everybody, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Made some new friends and uh, had to keep it private, guys. Had to keep it private. Let me check. How much longer do I have? I lost track of everything now. Uh, I did enjoy some ice cream, man. I, I needed it. I needed it. Oh man, 1041. Let's see, maybe we have time for a little ride. I really wanted to go to um, It's a Small World. I don't know, I know a lot of you don't like It's a Small World. I really wanted to go there, go there today. But hey, if Speedway is open, I think I might take a, a drive on the Speedway. Yeah, it's open. Tomorrowland Speedway, let's do it, let's do it. Did it yesterday, but I want to do it again. Let's get to the victory circle.
All right, guys, I'm ready to race. I'm back in business. I love when the lines get, get short and you can just walk on, man. The only thing is I'm running out of time. Let's see how many rides I can get in. 20 minutes, probably just this one, probably. I'll try to get on another one if I can.
matter how many times I ride and drive these cars. I just love these cars, man. These cars are just cool. Tomorrow night speedway. <laughs> Gotta love it. Five minutes. Thank you. <laughs> five minutes, five minutes. What can we do in five minutes? Man, I'm not gonna make it to the pirates. Uh, I want to ride the pirates. 1056, four minutes. Oh my god. Four minutes, four minutes. Yeah, it's just like a repeat of yesterday <laughs> where I'm doing um, I'm stuck in this area here now I only got four minutes I did teacups yesterday so let me see if I can make it to Winnie the Pooh didn't do that one yesterday yeah I can make it to Winnie the Pooh for Sarah for Sarah from Canada Winnie the Pooh one of your favorites, Sarah. 
Let's see, let's see if I make it on time. I'm trying. Will I make it? Will I make it? Wow, teacups is empty. I could go. <laughs> teacups is like a walk on right now. Look at that. What about Pooh Bear? What about Pooh Bear? Is it open? Is it closed? It's too Pooh Bear. Oh, man, is it closed? I think it's still open. Yay. I wanted to ride this one on Sunday, but couldn't, couldn't. So maybe today is the day. Whew. I'm walking, I'm walking, I'm walking fast. Wow, it's a walk on, guys. It's a walk on. This is how I like it, man. That one hour wait, that sucks. <laughs> This is good. So please take a secret. How are you? Alright. Let me switch this so you can enjoy the ride. Chapter two, in which we join Who and his friends in a very blustery day. It's gonna be blustery. Wednesday. If you ask me, he'll never reach that. Broke down the door. Here, 
look at Pooh Bear. <laughs> Christopher Robin! And we're done. <laughs> Sorry. There we go. That's oh, a heavy gate. Do we have time for anything else? I doubt it. I doubt it. Let's see. 11.03. No time. Yeah, Eric, mine train is closed. 70 space, what's up? <laughs> Jar of honey from a character with the last name of Pooh. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, that's it. I think all rides are closed now. sword today nobody so far Sarah may have missed it but it was Pooh Bear for Sarah and Michael Michael Kenneth I know you guys love the ride. Finally, walking through the castle. First time today, going right through the middle. guys and these guys and who's that guy and that girl are these uh oh someone else looks mad here yeah she's mad I remember that part once Oh wow, look at all the people, oh my god. I remember when people used to leave early. And now people leave so late. <clears throat> Tim Rose. 
Just like the old days, Tim. <laughs> yeah. Sarah, I just did Pooh Bear for you guys. For you and Michael Kenneth and the family. If you didn't see it, rewind. That was my last ride. Oh, you did hear your name. <laughs> I'm reading backwards everything. Oh, he was vacuuming. Good job, Michael. <laughs> I can't complain about that. Michael was vacuuming me in the house. Good man right there. Yeah, man, look at all the people, Sarah. It's like we're standing on stage here at the... Oh. You wanna get in the middle? <laughs> Thanks for being here, Sarah. <laughs> You're welcome, Michael. You're welcome. Yay! 70 space. I haven't seen you in a long time. And we're back at the castle. I think we had enough castle for today, right? <laughs> Been filming the castle like all night. <laughs> Felt like I was there for like two hours almost doing fireworks. By the way, guys, doing fireworks, I was running two cameras, one in each hand. So I just had a feeling that maybe something might happen to the feed, to the stream. I mean, and and uh, so I got it on video. <clears throat> There's a couple times when I did have to move, so my uh, camera, my regular camera, may have not done a perfect job, but we'll see, we'll see. I'm gonna have to uh, come up with an idea for that footage. I did shoot it vertical, so let's see what I do with that. Oh, let's check out the statues because they're going to be leaving soon, I think. There's Goofy and Pluto. I think they'll be leaving with the 50th uh, celebration when it's gone now. There's Pluto. And we're going to come up to Mickey and Minnie now. I wonder if Tinkerbell is still over there. You know, I haven't even searched for Tinkerbell. It's been a while. Oh, Minnie's Matthew. talking. <laughs> Thank you, Minnie. And Mickey. Mickey, you say anything? Mickey. Mickey, Mickey, Mickey. Come on, Mickey. They're not reading my bracelet. Ice cream parlor.
Favorite marquees, always gotta check this out. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Love it. It's so awesome. <laughs> oh wow, look at this. <laughs> Hopscotch with Mickey Mouse. I just realized I better film that. I've never seen that before. Let me film that real quick. I think that's gonna work. <laughs> I wish I'd done it in uh, fast motion. <laughs> Perfect. Center Street. Looking so nice and clean. Now we got some people leaving. Jim, Jim, Jim. Jim. All right, my buddy. daughter. You know, my daughter oh, says to me, guys, she says, YouTuber. You talk to somebody that I watch. Oh, wow, she really? Already watches. You watch yeah. me? You want to be on? Can, can, can she be on? Yeah, she yeah. can be on. Say hello to everybody. Hi. And Hi. Disney. These are my friends from Michigan I was telling you guys about. I just met Jim. Uh, so that's who I was talking to. And here's the family. Here's family. <laughs> hey, guys, have a great hey, trip. Thanks a lot, Mark. You're going to be here a few more days? No, nope, this is it. Oh, well. I hope you guys had a great time. Yeah, we did. All right. Thank you. Thanks, Mark. Bye, guys. <laughs> oh, man, what a nice family. Jim from Michigan. So nice to meet you guys. That's so nice. They took a picture of me with, uh, with the kids. Awesome. Dominic, <clears throat>
much darker over here. Let me see if this works. That's a little lighter right there. <laughs> I need some water. Let's grab some water over here. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Yeah. Water right here. All right, you guys drink from the small one. I'll drink from this one over here. All right, that was good. <laughs> Little water. Yeah, Tim, it feels like the old days, man. <laughs> this part right here reminds me of a bunch of, bunch of stuff <laughs> we did on stream. <laughs> Even some crazy dancing.
Kevin, Kevin Rogers, what's up, buddy? How's it going? Good to see you again, Kevin. Welcome, welcome. Tim's here, Mike Beachman's here. We got Kevin, we got Eric. Five more days left out of this crazy 50th. <laughs> yeah, Eric, five more days. Then it's gonna be the 100. <laughs> I wonder how long we're gonna celebrate the 100. It is a big milestone, I gotta say. The magic in me, Michael. <laughs> the weather is hot. <laughs> the weather, Sarah, is very hot. <laughs> Mike, I missed that. When you're saying I had to sing, I was on stage. Yeah, man, we kind of were like on the uh, on the uh, stage over there. Billy, what's up, Billy? You're welcome, Billy. Good to see you again. Sarah's here, still awake. Awesome. You don't sleep anymore, Sarah. You got two kids. <laughs> How you been, Billy? Everything good? Still gotta sing? Oh, man. How we doing on legs, guys? 56. Man, I had made it to where 100 was the, the singing point, Mike, but it hasn't really worked. <laughs> we get close, but no cigar. Man, you know, even me been wanting to go to one of the concerts, but we've been so busy, we haven't gone to any of the Epcot concerts this year. Which one would you go to if you were here in town? Would you go to one of the Epcot concerts? And if you would, which one? I want to see some of the new ones that I hadn't seen. Because the ones from last year, I mean, really, it feels like I saw them the other day. So I didn't want to really repeat the ones we saw. We saw Cool in the Gang. We saw Village People. We saw Simple Plan, um, Rick Springfield, Journey. Um, who else? Who else? Man, we, we saw a lot of concerts. And uh, kind of didn't want to do um, the same ones. I was hoping to uh, catch some of the other ones that I hadn't seen. So this year I saw Tommy DiCarlo and um, part of the M80 show. Which they're awesome. And you know, the singer from M80, M80s is a singer that took over for LA Guns Part 2. <sighs> now there's two LA Guns bands because half of the band got in a fight with the other half. So two of the uh, guys got new guys. And then, and then uh, the drummer got himself, put himself another, like another band together. And they're both called LA Guns, and I guess for legal matters, they're just gonna keep it like that. They were gonna like, they were probably mad at each other about who's gonna use the name, but they just said, you know what? We'll just go on. I'm sure they're mad at each other and whatever. But uh, yeah, so LA Guns, there's two LA Guns. And one of them is under a Disney contract. I don't know how it works, but the singer for one of the LA Guns, who has a really nice song that he put out last year. Maybe one or two years ago already. Oh, time flies, man. Can I remember the name of the song? It's a really good song. Well, he sings with the band at Epcot. Um, in the um, UK Pavilion. He also does, works with M80s. He works with the Hooligans. He works with a lot of bands. He's very talented, man. He used to be in a Kiss tribute band as well. 
play at Ace Frehley's part. Um, Kurt, man, he's so talented. Great voice, great chops on the guitar, and good songwriter as well. I like those. I like the song that he came up with. It's really nice. So if there's any rockers out there that like LA Guns, little LA Guns talk here. There might be somebody out there that doesn't uh, talk in the chat who knows about LA, LA Guns. Um, the one album, my, my favorite album from LA Guns is the one that has all the controversy going on on who wrote the songs. Supposedly, it's not even the guys that put the record out. It was a guy who had broken up with them or whatever, and he's the one who had written all the songs. It's a really cool interview by Jason Green. Jason Green also interviewed Kurt from the M80s on his YouTube channel. Check out Jason, Jason Green. Um, his buddy, Johnny, who he, who he uh, does a lot of the shows with, who also lives in, lives in Vegas. I saw him when I was in Vegas. Remember when I went to Vegas and I did live streams over there? I went and saw Johnny and I met Johnny. I talked to him, took a picture. Johnny um, is now playing guitar for Rat. And all thanks to Jason. Jason hooked them up all together. Johnny had auditioned for Rat a long time ago and didn't make it, I mean, you know, for weird reasons. But anyways, they are touring now together. And uh, Jason Green is their tour manager. So a little shout out to Jason Green and a little plug for his YouTube channel, which is really cool because Jason does interview a lot of cool people in the music business, including the guy who wrote the Karate Kid songs. Those interviews that he did with him are really cool. And there's other interviews with some of the members of, of uh, Cobra Kai and some of the actors from Cobra Kai and some of the actors from Karate Kid. Man, he does some really cool interviews, man. He gets, he knows a lot of people, so he's, you know, he's uh, done some really cool interviews. I, I find him interesting. If you like uh, music interviews and maybe um, actor interviews, he's done some actors interviews, which have been really, really cool. Really nice interviews. And uh, when him or John and Johnny are together, they're kind of funny. <laughs> And they, they live in Vegas. So when I was in Vegas with Eva, we went and saw Johnny. Johnny was performing uh, right, in, right in front of New York. Uh, New York, New York, whatever it's called. That New York hotel over there. Crawling outside there on the sidewalk. He's a great guitar player, man. He played with Enough's Enough when uh, Enough's Enough split up and whatever. He used to sing for Enough's Enough. He sang and played guitar. Johnny. Uh, pretty cool, pretty cool. Yeah, I watch them whenever I get a chance. I'm running behind them, probably some of the videos. I haven't been able to keep up with all my uh, people that I like to uh, watch on YouTube and stuff like that. Time, you know, time. It takes time to watch <laughs> watch uh, videos. <laughs> it takes a lot of time. You gotta be not too busy. I'm a busy man. Eva's a busy girl. I'm a busy man. We're pretty busy all the time. It's a miracle we make it out to the parks. Well, you know, that's our thing. We love it here. <laughs> it's not a miracle. <laughs> not a miracle at all. What? Kevin, are you giving memberships? What did I miss? What did I miss? What did I miss? Oh, wow. Kevin, thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you so much for supporting the channel so much. Man, you do so much for me. Thank you, Kevin. Oh, my. <laughs> Mike Beachman, now I saw what you... I owe you guys because I, I kept you waiting. Oh, my God. I was... Man, I lost track of time. I was talking with uh, Jim. I met Jim and and uh, 
such a cool guy, man, from Michigan. Yeah, we were just talking away, talking away, talking away. It was interesting. It was it was really really nice. So I did not eat my ice cream by myself. I ate ice cream and a little bit of soda, you know, like a, one of those floats. I just needed something cold, man. It was it's pretty hot tonight. Tim Rose asleep for the week? What? <laughs> Sarah, I never sleep. <laughs> Good to know, Billy. Good to know. You're doing well. Well, thank you, uh, Tim, for giving the uh, membership. That's awesome. Tim Rose is now a member. Awesome. Oh, yeah, Eric. Man, Harmonious is a nightmare to uh, stream. I've... I have streamed Harmonious Live so many times. I think I have a backlog of like 25 videos that are still, I'm still editing them. I've edited so many, but it takes really long. Like you put in a mute request and it could take up to three days for one song. And then each one has like 30, 32 songs that are copyrighted. And you, it takes like three days to mute one song and then you got to mute another one and then Oh my God, it takes more than a month to just mute one harmonious show so that you can keep the visual, you know? Um, I have recorded harmonious so many times that um, I still have a bunch. I was just checking, I think it was a day before yesterday. I was like, oh my God, I still have so many. Because I have them muting, you know, on each one, muting a song. But there's still like, some have 17 to go, some have 20 something to go, some have maybe five or six to go there's like you know because they're i'm muting them as i go as i go so man it's like uh it's crazy how that works i don't know why they do that i mean we're giving them so much they don't even know we are i mean i've become an influencer without planning to be an influencer i just you know um i have so many people telling me oh man i see you having fun so i packed up and came over here or they talk about somebody else doing it, the same same thing. Because I run into people and talk to them, and they're like, man, if it wasn't because of streamers, I wouldn't uh, be here. Or for bloggers, maybe bloggers or streamers, uh, Disney bloggers or Disney streamers. Because, you know, things I didn't think about happen here. It's really cool. And I even heard of people moving here because of just watching uh, blogs and streams. So I know because of the amount of people that have told me to my face, um, thank you, you know, you, you helped us, whatever. When I saw how easy it is to drive from the airport to Disney, it made me want to go on a trip because it's, it's, like it's like a breeze to get there. Yeah, man, I mean, I know I've helped a lot of people because they've told me. Eric! Oh, what's up, man? What's up, dude? What's up? Look, Eric's here, guys, from Mystic Parks. How you doing, man? What's up, buddy? I didn't expect you to see you two days in a row. I thought you were, like, not coming today. No, I wanted I wanted to come in. I thought you were like in California time. already. <laughs> no, on the 30th. I'm going. Oh, okay. I thought yesterday was your last time. So today's your last, last time? Yesterday was my last full day. Today I just did a couple rides that I didn't get to do yesterday. Okay. That's what I was so trying I, to do. I, I wanted to get on Big Thunder Mountain here yeah. and stuff. So when I get over there, I can compare it better. Oh, okay. Yeah, I get, I get that. That's the last ride I got to go on tonight. So. so what day do you leave to California? Is it public or is it private? It's the 30th. And I'm going live right when I get there. So that's Thursday. Yeah. I'm gonna have some, uh, I'm gonna be very tired. Oh yeah, yeah, everybody, you know, jet lag. I, yeah. I have like a five in the morning flight. Yeah. And then they're, they're like three hours behind. Yeah. So I'll start the live pretty much right when I land. So guys, this is Eric. He's gonna be streaming from California on Thursday. Yes, I he's am. He's gonna be half be asleep, awesome. but he's gonna be streaming from California. <laughs> yeah, I'm California. going to. I'll be uh, probably doing two live streams that day. So I'll probably oh, wow. be going live for like 10, 12 Are you hours. staying at the Disney hotel? No, I'm staying at um, a Marriott and Hilton. Cool. Because the Disney Hotel is a little up there right now. Yeah, 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 it is. I know we talked about everything ye yesterday, but, you know, yeah, it's, I forget it's everything. It's like crazy. <laughs> prices and stuff. Yeah, yeah. What would you end up doing today? Get on a lot of the rides? Oh, I did uh, fireworks. That's that's what I wanted, kind of like wanted to do today. And then I was having second thoughts because so many people. I was like, oh, my God. But I did it. I did it from up front. Yeah, when I came in... Fire 
by the time I got to the Tomorrowland, the, the finale was going off, so I watched from over there. Oh, okay. And I said, that's the last finale I'll see of this enchantment. <laughs> okay. Yesterday, I saw fireworks from when I was driving the cars at, at Speedway. So today, just because the lines were crazy after fireworks, I'm like, oh my god, bro. Every line was like almost an hour or whatever. Yeah, yes so, yesterday, I, I saw it from um, Seven Doors, and I yeah. got the grand finale in Oh, there. sweet. It was amazing. You were on the ride? Yeah. While it was happening? How can you film on the ride? That's so fast. That ride is so fast. Well, th this gimbal allows me to do so. Really? That's, that's why I did No, like I've done it, but I've done it, but you know, it's like, like I gotta like hold it really tight because man, there's a couple drops there, man. So what you do is you get this. I put it against my chest. You get this gimbal right here. Yeah. And I just do this. Oh, okay, cool. Good idea. Yeah. And it goes nowhere. Cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good, good. So I, I was like, I learned that from like when I did some filming school. Awesome, bro. A long time ago. Yeah, yeah. Because we used to have bigger gimbals, like, with the DSLRs on there and everything, before yeah. they had the mirrorless. And the yeah, I've seen them. They're mirrorless. crazy, man. Crazy big. <laughs> oh, yeah. And then there's even ones that, like, get so big, they're bigger than that trash can, and then you have this whole backpack on. Yeah. And it has, like, this boom handle with hydraulic system in it, so it helps balance <laughs> it on your back, so you don't, like... Uh, right, right. But it's amazing. It's cool, yeah. It's really cool stuff, now man. You, all you need is this little small camera instead of a gigantic setup. Yeah. Time is it, man. I don't want to be here too long. 11.39. I'm going to start heading out. Well, awesome. Bro. Nice seeing you, man. Good seeing you. You going to stay a little longer? I'll probably stay just a few, a little bit longer. I did, uh, today I was only able to do Pooh Ride, uh, Winnie the Pooh, and Speedway again because, dude, I walked around, I wanted to do Pirates and whatever. Everything was like so long, man. Yeah, I, I did like, Tomorrowland, uh, People Mover, I did Winnie the Pooh, Teacups, Seven Dwarves, You, you didn't stop to watch the show, you just kept going? Yeah, I legit walked right in yeah. as the fire was going off, went on the people mover. After the people mover, yeah. I got stuck on there for a little bit. Oh, yeah? But then I walked right to the pool and uh, boo, it was yeah. like a 15 minute wait. I almost did that, man, because I've done it so many times, you know, while fireworks was going on, you can do like sometimes up to seven, maybe more rides than that. Yeah, I know, it's ridiculous because yeah. everybody wants to come watch it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but I was like, oh man, I think, I think I'm think i due to like film the show. <laughs> Yeah, because I haven't, I haven't filmed it in a while. So, uh... At least it doesn't take your video down like Harmonious. I don't know, man. I was thinking, man, I'm probably going to get taken down because I recorded the whole show. No, it just took That's That song, uh, The Magic, whatever. Magic is Calling is always a problem. Well, that and the Frozen songs. Oh, Frozen. Yeah. Man, I got blocked at Hollywood Studios for the Frozen show. The first time I filmed it. Like, so, they blocked... There's three things that you can't really film. Sometimes it happens with uh, Phil Hard Magic, but not always. Yeah, I've never had problems there. Um, but 100% with the, um, the whole uh, Frozen show at yeah. Hollywood Studios, and for sure, Harmonious at Also, the Mickey Mouse shorts. I recorded those one day, and I was like, oh my god. Get, I got they blocked. Didn't, they didn't get blocked for me when I recorded it. You got the, the, the sound, or just the... I just got the copyright. And I just, oh. and all I did was just remove that. No, dude, I got blocked. I had to... Luckily, they let me trim the segment out. Yeah, I had... As long as you're under then that was my hours. only option. I, they gave me that. That was the only option. Trim, or the, the, the video just won't come back. I tried to the live stream more than six hours with one video. Yeah, so you, can, so you can trim, yeah. <laughs> trim or, or whatever, mute. <laughs> that was my splash mountain video. I ended up forgetting to do a part two. Yeah. And then I couldn't... Man, I have so many harmonious videos that are muted now <laughs> because of all the issues. But I have like 20 or more that I counted two, like two or three days ago that I'm still dealing with uh, muting the, 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 the can, sound. You can download your own non copyrighted Disney music that yeah. sounds similar and then put it over it and then. And then reload. Go. Reload, yeah. Is that what you're talking about? Reloading it? Yeah, because you can add sound to it, and right. you can add your own sounds to it from your own computer, as long as you have a computer to do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can do non-copyrighted music, so... I've done it, but I don't know why. If you don't do it, if you do it while the video's there, that you, not like downloading it into your computer, if you do it there, I don't know why on mine, it always... Like, I set everything up, I spend a lot of time putting all the music, and then, like, the next day or whenever I go check, it has moved my songs off from where they're supposed to be. So now the song is still like showing that it's uh, not covered up. That's weird. So yeah, and it moves so everything. Moved, so it moved off 
Okay. Yeah, and it always happens, man. Whenever I do it that way. So the the one thing I did was just like download my videos and then put the music I over did it for in the my first computer. Couple videos and then I had to start trimming everything instead for now on. I know, dude. This is quite a headache, man. And trimming takes hours. Dude, I have just one minute. I have a harmonious hour. video that had past ten thousand views and they and they just blocked it after I already had all those views and just blocked it. I'm like, oh my god. It's just harmonious, nothing else. That's yeah, so it's crazy because I've had an intro on all my older videos, yeah. my wrestling videos, and every single one of them still has the intro and outro. But the one that got extremely popular, they copyrighted the intro and outro, so they told me to remove it. But all the other ones still have it, so I don't understand why that yeah. matters. Maybe they see the, the attraction that it's gaining, so yeah. they want to get paid for it. Dude, I was That's just talking about that. We're giving, we're giving like harmonious and the park itself everything they're all they're getting so much publicity it's like being an influencer without wanting to be one you know you're, you're people just go crazy they love it they love it then they want to come and see it for themselves so we're helping but they they ruin it for us you know? exactly. I, mean, it's I don't know us, i wish you know I, wish. I understand some you know the part you know the money part and all that so i guess you know well the thing is i think this is how it is they have their own video of harmonious on their disney plus they don't want you to watch it on someone's live stream yeah. for free. Yeah, I heard because UMG, is it UMG or whatever, who uh, just got the rights to, to play it on uh, like a yeah. pay-per-view thing? I mean, like a streaming service or something? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. So supposedly for years it's been a rumor that Disney's going to have their own live streamers, but you already know that's BS. Yeah. I mean, if it ever happens, I don't think they'll ever do anything about us live streaming. A lot of people think, oh, Japan's doing it, Japan's doing it. No, or Hong just, Kong or something like that. That's, that's all different circumstances. And that's though. because that's a government law. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's different over there. It's another world over there, man. <laughs> exactly. No, no, here I think um, everything's cool here, man. I think, you know. Everybody loves it. Every cast member Dude, every, waves high. And yeah, and almost everybody here. There's more people streaming than you think with just their phone in their hand. And then a lot of people come up to you, what's your channel, what's your channel, what's your channel? Yeah. So that's why I started making the cards because I'm like, instead of having to type it out for them. Yeah. So you were going that way or are you going? I'm heading out already. I mean, I'm going all over the place, but <laughs> you have a good one, man. I'll right, probably see you around more. Yeah, man. I get back. Yeah, I just recognize you, man. I'm like, wow. I'll, I'll let you know when I'm back and uh, they won't be surprised or something. Sure, man. Enjoy. Enjoy your trip. All right. Yeah, I'm going to start heading out, guys. We'll ride. Hey. Unless I want to walk to to my car, which is all the way at the end, I think I'll I think I'll, I'll think I'll take the tram, man. I'm pretty far today. I'm pretty far. Pretty far. Not the last row, but you know, not too far from the last row. Much closer to the last row than closer to the park, or the uh, not the park, but the uh, the monorail. <laughs> Oh, still selling popcorn. Popcorn! Man, squirrels and birds here must eat so much popcorn. And the ducks. Look, more popcorn on the floor. See, that's going to be future duck food. Unless they pick it up fast. Uh oh, looks like somebody may have had heart attack. That's so sad to get sick here on your vacation. Very sad, very sad.
I think that's a Mary Poppins song, right? Sounds like a Mary, Pop Mary Poppins song. I'm here. I'm in the corner, guys. <laughs> it's me, Superman. <laughs> Got my Superman shirt. I just realized because I'm seeing myself on the thing. Shout out to the lady who told me I had a really nice shirt. <laughs> That happened when I was riding the tram. Thank you, thank you again for saying I have a beautiful shirt. <laughs> she liked it, she liked the Superman shirt. All right, did my incline, look at that, it's pretty, pretty much inclined there. Either way, Dad. Oh, the other side looks cool. Oh, here it comes. Looks like maybe monorail orange. Monorail orange. Here we go. Here they come.
like tower reminds me of uh, Lisa Mack and Popcorn Brick. Oh yeah, Ben, it's beautiful. Great hotel. I have great memories from our first stay here. It was awesome. I've stayed here twice, never heard the monorails passing by in the room. Never. Good night, Drew. Thank you for stopping by, Drew. Good evening and welcome aboard Monorail Orange. Our next stop will be the Transportation and Ticket Center. If you are standing, please hold on to those silver handrails and never lean against the automatic doors. Thank you. This is a gimbal. What is it called? Gimbal. Gimbal, yeah. 
Amazon. You can get them on Amazon for like $120. <laughs> Bye. Seven D space. Oh, there's a monorail parked right over there waiting to get the go-ahead. What's up? Where to today? Oh, I just, I just got off the monorail. Oh, gotcha, yeah, yeah. gotcha. Heading to, to parking? Heading to the parking lot, but I see him like oh, on this beam. Yeah, we, we wanna, actually have a. Oh, sorry. I want to get where? a picture. I want to get a picture of him. I oh, think he's yeah, coming. Yeah. Uh, so he's gonna. Let's see. He's waiting for. He's oh, there's a one right there. Sure that's why. Park here for about another two minutes or so. Oh, that's why he's. Making sure that they're all clear. Yeah. yeah. And then, uh, and then after this one moves, that one will come in. Oh, okay. Man, <laughs> that's all good. I don't know. Maybe I'll wait for him. Is yeah, it all right? Sure, Is sure. it? Yeah, yeah. I think he's on this beam, right? Yeah, exactly. He's gonna be coming right over there. And then, yeah. Oh, there. That one's leaving now, so cool. Oh, yep, there, <laughs> there he comes. Oh, there's one on this side. Oh my God. That's funny, I got two of them. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Good night. You too. All right, guys, we're going to walk through security, so I'm going to have to put this down for a second as we walk through. And yeah, we're going to ride the tram, parking lot tram.
All right, we're getting on. Last ride of the night. <laughs> Just when you thought it was over, another ride. Hopefully not. To my friends on board, this is a Billings Courtesy Tram, and we are going out to Scar and Captain Hook. Captain Hook and Scar. Rails 312 through 328 and 410 through 426. Welcome aboard. Thank you. and the 400s. Yeah, it was my 
Welcome to you, my friends. Actually, we are no longer boarding this tram at this time, but we do appreciate your patience as you wait for the next one. Just remain all the way behind that yellow safety line. Huh? Well, we have to get off? With all of that being said, driver, we are clear for dispatch. Driver, we are clear for dispatch. For your safety, remain seated with the doors closed, keeping your hands, arms, feet, and legs inside while the tram is moving, and supervise your children. Thank you. I gotta say I've had a great time tonight <laughs> awesome to see you guys to everyone who, st who stopped by thank you so much it means a lot all your support guys and uh, that was our last ride for the night the parking lot tram <laughs> so um so awesome gotta love the parking lot tram there they go Goodbye, tram. <laughs> Unfortunately, 
what a night. Yeah, I'm almost, almost at the end, but not quite. Not that many cars left. Wow. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Thanks for being here. I'm going to let it run a little bit because this one is tricky. This stream stays open for a little bit. Sometimes half an hour, maybe an hour. I'm going to click it off and see if it works. But um, I think that's what happens. And um, thank you, Kevin, again, for uh, gifting some memberships. Thanks to all the club members. The Mouse Club keeps the Mouse Club uh, keeps growing, and it's just another way to support the channel. Thank you guys. It's awesome to have you guys as part of the Mouse Club. And I'm like I was saying earlier, I was trying to come up with some some something to make it fun, to make the Mouse Club fun. But I just just haven't come up with something that's really cool. So gotta keep keep working on that. And um, yeah, it was really nice today. Hot but nice. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for everything. I'll see you in the next one. I'm going to just let it run a little bit. And then I'll take my walk all the way to the car. I'm all the way by the grass. By those buses over there. Not down there. See those buses driving by? I'm, I'm on the, <laughs> all the way over there. Oh, my God. Yeah. But I got to walk all the way back there. <laughs> all right, guys. I'm going to let it roll a little bit. Good night, everybody. Just don't forget, reach for the stars and never give up on your dream. And I'll see you guys in the next one. It's fun when you come down here with a big group. It's so fun. There goes the goofy bus.